Welcome to another Studio tutorial. In this video, we're going to talk about the Studio dashboard and how to create a new project. To create a new project, first log in, and then you can click Create New Project. You can choose to start your project off with a blank website or with a professional template. And you can choose any one of these templates here, or if you'd like to preview or try them out with the editor, you have those options as well. Let's start with this project here. We can give our project a name and hit return or click on create. There are two ways to access the project dashboard when you want to manage your project. And the first way is if you're already in the editor here, you can click on the project name here at the top and this will take you to the dashboard. Or if you're logged out, you can simply click login. And instead of creating a new project, we now have the option to jump right into the editor or jump into the dashboard right from logging in. So let's do that here. The first thing we can do in the dashboard is edit our project cover. And we already have a project cover uploaded here for the template, but if we ever want to change this, we can click on this camera icon and we can find what image we want to replace it with and just go ahead and save that. We can also delete any projects that we'd like by clicking on the studio icon on the top left and we can navigate to the projects that we want to delete and just click this X icon to the top right of any project. Now Studio will ask if you want to confirm this and you can confirm archiving this project and you can always access that later in this archived tab. Now there are other settings in the project dashboard. The first one is live preview and this will let you create or deactivate a shareable live preview link. You can also publish your project with a free plan or upgrade to a premium plan. You can view, add and delete project members and edit authorizations. You can view the different pages in your project and edit the page URL paths as well as meta tags, social covers, and favicons. And also see your form submissions and add or edit notification addresses where these forms are going to be submitted. Lastly, in the dashboard, you can connect third-party apps such as Analytics, Intercom, and Search Console. Let's take a look at account settings. If you hover over your account icon, you have some settings that you can set for your profile, email address, password, and you can also toggle dark mode on and off under the account menu. And that's a quick look at the dashboard, creating new projects, and finding your account settings.